hello guys and welcome back to today's video my name is Zik, the programming guy in today's video i will show you how to upload your music to all major platforms for free whether you are an independent artist or just getting started this guide will help you get your music out there first you need to select a free music distribution service some popular options include amuse root notes and sound drop these platforms allows you to upload your music to streaming platforms like spotify app music and many more at no cost for this tutorial, we are going to use Root Notes. It's easy to use and offers a free plan that covers all the major platforms. So the first step we want to take is to head to rootnote.com and sign up for an account. Alright, so after signing up for an account, then you have to log in. In case you don't know how to sign up on Root Notes, I have a video that I'm going to add at the top of this one. So go ahead and watch how to create an account on Root Notes. So after that, the next thing you want to do is to come over here from your dashboard, you find this distribute a release go ahead and click on that next you just have to go ahead and enter your song title for example i'll call this song title love story and then the next thing i want to do is to click on create release next we have to complete the release details so i'm going to click on album details to start with and uh, then a few information is required to be completed um so i'll scroll down and uh, then I'll start with the artist name. So go ahead and enter your artist name. If you have a profile already on Spotify or App Music, make sure you go ahead and enter the name right there so that you can select from here. But if you don't have a profile on any of these platform, enter the artist name that you want to use for all your profiles and then click on this create a new profile. Once that is done, the next thing is the writer's name or the composer's name. So you have to enter the writer's name in full and uh, then the next thing that is needed is to select yes if your release contains uh, lyrics if not select no now for the primary genre i'll click on this drop down and select blues for the secondary i'm not going to add anything there for the composition copyright you have to click here select a year and uh, then you have to enter your label name or your artist name right here and then for the record label name if you are under a record label enter the name right here but if you're not you have to uh, enter your artist name right there but do not leave it blank all right so for this other one originally released i don't know why this information is needed because i have not released a song before so i don't know why this is needed but i'm just going to select a backdated date and then proceed so the next thing is the pre-order date when you want people to start pre-ordering your song so I'll, I'll click on 22nd of august or i think i should bring it i should extend it to 30th of august and uh, for the sales start date when you want your song to be released uh i'll select um 27th of september and uh, you have to add a time if you want or you can allow root notes to release your song within uh, this date anytime within this date and uh, then the next thing you have to do is to click on this explicit content and uh, then select explicit if it contains explicit or if not select not explicit then click on save and continue all right so as you can see right here we have completed this first step which is the album details and that's why we have it checked now the next thing is to add audio file so i'll click on this add audio and uh, then i'll take a look at this requirement this is the required audio file type and uh yeah it says the the upload to is restricted to 15 uploads per section so your upload should not exceed uh 15 right so uh, for me i'm just uploading uh, a single so I shouldn't bother about that so the the title of the track of course we added love story next is to choose our file so i'll click on choose file button and uh, then i will check for the file in my computer so i just come down here and search for search for it so this is it and uh, i'll click on open and uh, then I can add more tracks as you can see like it's stated here you can add up to 15 if you are trying to upload an album so come over here click on add track to add another one so if you click on add it gives you room to upload the next one 
but I don't want to upload more than one. I just want to upload a single, so that's not needed for me. I'll click on this remove track and uh, click on delete track. Then now, next is to click on save and continue. All right, there's an error. It says, please choose MP3 file or FLAC file only. All right, the file I selected was WAV file, which was, um, which is something that most distribution requests for. So uh, for root notes is MP3 or FLAC. So I will select my audio again and select this other one because I have it in both MP3 and also I have WAV file. So I'll select this other one and as you can see, it has that uploading all right so we have to wait for upload to be completed and then we can now click on save and continue next we have to uh, enter the title version this was already entered before well i can say that root note is kind of complicated so um we just have to review all the details we've entered and uh, then i'll click on save and continue and then if you are sure you finish uploading for this release you can just click on unfinished but if you feel like adding more tracks or you have more tracks to add just click on this one right here for me i'll click on unfinished and uh, then this will take us to the next part where we can now add our ads work All right so as you can see this two part is uh, ticked that means we've completed it so now we have to proceed to the artwork so i'll click on artwork button and uh, then we have to choose our artwork from our computer and of course you need to meet a certain requirement for the artwork so just come right here and check the required artwork uh, size and also the format okay so once you have um, checked that all right so you can see scroll down there there are more requirements so yeah this is the size this is the the quality and it should be less than uh 25 mb and it should be rgb color space and uh should not contain any website url blah 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 just go through all this and once you are sure that your already designed artwork meets the requirement so come right here and click on this select files to upload in case if you want me to show you how to design an artwork that will meet the requirements, let me know in the comment section down below and I'll help you guys with that. But make sure you subscribe to this channel and give this video a like. That will help me reach more audience on YouTube. Alright, so I'm going to select the artwork that I've already designed and then I'll click on open and it will start loading for us right here. Alright, as you can see that is loaded. But if there is any glitch like any mistake or your design doesn't meet the requirements it won't be uploaded so that's it so all right so the next thing i want to do is to scroll down and click on save and continue all right so as you can see we've completed the third step which is add artwork so the next one is to manage stores so in this part we have to select the stores we want our music to be delivered like apple music uh, spotify blah 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 as many as you want so by default all stores will be selected for you but in case you don't want your song to be delivered in any of them you can just come and uncheck any of the store right boy i prefer delivering my song to all platforms so i will leave everything checked and then i'll scroll down and select the territories where i want my song to be distributed or you can just leave it just like that do not select anyone you can just leave it just like that so that uh, read notes is going to distribute your song to all territories worldwide so what you have to do next is to click on save and continue to move to the next part all right so we have completed all steps now the final thing we want to do is to check this box to accept root note terms and condition so come over here click on this link to read the terms and condition all right so the next thing you want to do is to decide whether to distribute free or distribute premium like i said in the beginning of the video you can distribute on root note for free or you can choose to distribute after uh, subscribing to root note premium now what this does that if you want choose to distribute for free it means that uh, root note is going to keep 15 percent of your royalties but if you distribute premium then you are you can keep 100 percent of your royalties but you need to pay uh this uh, certain amount per single ten dollar per single if you want to upload a single you have to pay ten dollar 
EP you have to pay $20, album you have to pay $30 and so on. So that's it. Then if you want to pay annually, you can just pay $9.99, uh, which is even more better. All right. So for me, uh, we just select distribute free and then this will be distributed. So let's go ahead and do that. Now here it says uh, release with free distribution. No further changes can be made to the release after completing. Are you sure you want to complete it with our free distribution plan? If you're sure about that, just go ahead and click on complete release. All right, so here it says you have one release in your library and uh, that means we have successfully uh, uploaded our music to read notes. Now it will take a few days for our music to be distributed to the selected platform, all right? So that's it guys, this is how you can actually distribute your music using the root notes hope this video was helpful and you now know how to do it if yes give this video a like and equally subscribe to get more helpful tips like this thanks for watching guys